Hello, and thanks for checking out the Vital Blend YouTube channel. I'm Anthony Vita. Do you know who this guy is? This is Paul Rogers of the band Bad Company. They've been around since the 70s. And you know, one of the things I've admired about Paul is that he just looks the same after all these years. And you can tell he's gotten older, but he looks like pretty much the same guy. I and mean, here he is uh, back in the 70s. I mean, this dude looks like he's in great shape then. And let's get a look at how he looks now. This is uh, Paul Rogers currently. And you can see this guy looks amazing. He's 65 years old, but you would never know it. How does he do it? What is Paul Rogers' secret to looking consistent over many, many decades? Well, a good friend of his, Eddie Trunk, who's a DJ up in New York, recently commented on Facebook, it is crazy how good Paul Rogers looks for his age. He is a total health guy, super strict vegan diet. So Paul Rogers has a uh, plant-based whole food diet that he sticks to, even when he's on the road. You know, I checked out his tour rider. This is a document, a, a contract that goes out to venues, kind of lays out the expectations as to uh, how the lighting needs to be set and the monitors and all that. But there's a whole section that goes into the dressing rooms and what the guys expect back there. Paul Rogers in his dressing room, he asks for organic fresh fruits, apples, bananas, avocado, lemon, water, all while next door his bandmates have uh, gotten vodka and Pepsi and cold cuts. But this is what's going on here. This is why Paul Rogers does such a great job with his health. His consistent look is his diet. You know, Weird Al's another guy. Look at him. This is someone who has also looked very consistent over the years. Here he is in the uh, 80s, and uh, here he is throughout the years. You know, what's his secret? Well, Rolling Stone recently caught up with him, and they learned a few things about him, and one of those things is that he's a vegan, mostly. Yeah, he cheats every now and then, has a little bit of dairy, but most of the time, he's eating a plant food diet. You know, unlike someone like Billy Joel, let's say. Now, I'm not knocking Billy. I love the guy, but he, his weight has been up and down and all around. You know, you can tell he doesn't look like the same guy in these in these photos, you know, Kirstie Alley is another one. She's an actress who has at times looked beautiful and then other times just been off the rails, you know, and she'll even tell you that, you know, she'll say, you know, she's been up and down and she was a spokesperson for Jenny Craig, which is a, a diet that's famous for calorie restriction. And you wind up getting very hungry and tempted to go eat the foods that, you know, as uh, she talks about her, her food demons like Chinese food and uh, a lot of butter. She goes on to talk about having toast with butter and uh, two cups of pasta and six tablespoons of butter. But what I found most interesting was how she talked about how for seven months uh, I was a vegetarian. I can't tell you how much weight I gained being a vegetarian, you know, eating uh, enchiladas with no meat and uh, eating bread with lots of carbs, almost making it sound like this is what was also adding to her weight gain. But this is what you need to be eating, folks. This is what, you know, is good for your body. When you eat carbs, your body turns them into simple sugars, which feed your cells. Your cells run on sugar, like your car runs on gas. You know, when you feed it butter, when you give it fat, guess what happens? You know, uh, Chinese food famous for being uh, fried in a lot of uh, fatty vegetable oils and MSG. And what is MSG? Well, it just so happens to be what they use to fatten up lab rats, you know. Uh, this is according to the uh, U.S. Library of Science. This is no secret, folks, that they uh, inject MSG into rats to fatten them up. MSG is found in a lot of foods that we eat when we go out, McDonald's, Burger King, KFC, Chick-fil-A, Pizza Hut, you name it. You go to the grocery store, it's in your soup mixes and sauces and noodles and all kinds of stuff. Uh, this is what's getting people into the most trouble. You know, if it's not eating saturated animal fat or dairy or vegetable oils, it's these chemicals like MSG. And when you don't understand how your body works, when you don't understand the effect of what you eat on how you look, this is what happens. You go up and down, you have a very inconsistent look. When you understand how to eat, this is how you look. You have a very consistent look about you. Again, Paul Rogers, 65 years old. He walks the talk. What do you think? Who do you see that uh, has kept their weight and 
uh, kept her health pretty much in balance after all these years. Actor, actresses, musicians, put it in the comments below. Click like and subscribe. And uh, thanks again. Join us for more videos here on the uh, Vital Blend YouTube channel. I'm Anthony Vita.